Welcome back guys, this is Beamer Merchant doing another do-it-yourself video. Today we'll be working on a driver front uh, window regulator out of a 98 BMW Z3 uh, Roadster. We've gone ahead and removed the door panel. Doing that will give you access to the parts you need to remove. Always remember, make sure there's power in your car because you are going to need to bring your regulator up and down. Let us get started. It's, if you noticed, I lowered the window about that high. Doing so allows me to remove two pins. One here, and the other one, if you slide down, it's right there. The tool I find more useful is this. It's a pick. With this pig, you're able to reach in there, slide the pin out. Careful because it's got some, uh, there, whoop, there you go, it's got some tension popped out. Same thing with this pig, I'm able to go in here and remove that pin. The pin looks like this here and here all right so the pins have been removed now we need to separate the glass from the regulator what I was able to do using this tool I wedged it in here use leverage and I popped out the joints I don't know if you can see it I'll show you more once the regulator is out what it's holding it but I did it on this side I'll do the same thing here and I believe it should be out because I heard a pop. There you go. So once I knew that the, those ball joints were out of the plastic tab, I just had someone press the window switch down and I was able to, let me see here. This is what they did, part it down and it was able to release from the glass. That's what I did. If you have a better method, please share with us. At this point, so you can actually lift the glass one-handed up and down. However, it won't come out because of this weather strip that goes all the way around the car here, all the way here. You're gonna use the same pulling method all the way around. With the weather strip removed, you can actually easily take this window out. We're done with this. This is the passenger side and uh, it's being held by two bolts, three and one, four. There's two in here. Three and then four right here. There's two connections uh, you need to remove. One here and the other one is right there. Disconnect those. All right, finally, I was able to get it out. It actually took me a while to remove this from the housing with all the bolts taken off. The problem I was having taking it out was this was open. It was uh, like this. And I could not get this in here to come out through here. So I went ahead and connected the, 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 the motor again, was able to bring it midway, and this is how I was able to remove it. Hey, other than that, I thank you for watching this video. If you need any parts for your Z3 or your BMW in general, E39, E46, please visit our uh, website posted below. All your support allows us to uh, do these types of videos and uh, continue helping the community uh, out. So thank you for watching. Be sure to subscribe. Have an awesome day. Take care.